What's going on everybody? Jeff West here with Heli Direct, and today we have a video on what really sets the Goose Sky apart from every other company on the market right now, which is this little Bluetooth module. So both your S2 and your RS4 have a really nice feature that come with them, which is this Bluetooth module. And this allows you to fine tune your helicopter and set them up right from your app on your phone at the flying field. It is a game changer and it really makes setting up these models extremely nice. So we have our Bluetooth module here and this little Bluetooth module plugs right on in your Goose Sky FBL, right on your UART port. So I just have mine on the RS4 double-sided taped here and I leave it on all the time. So you can leave your Bluetooth module plugged in every day, you do not have to unplug it. So it is just as simple as plugging your module into your helicopter and downloading the app. So you're gonna power up your helicopter. Once your model is powered up, you will notice that your Bluetooth module has a blinking light. So now that means that it is ready to go and we need to download the app on our phone. So let's go ahead and download the app on our phone. We're gonna open up our app store, type in Goose Sky and search for Goose Sky. Once you find your Goose Sky app, go ahead and download it. And then when it is ready to be opened, open it up. Now we are on the home screen here. So we're gonna go to Bluetooth and search for the device. You're gonna scroll down till you see Goose Guy. Go ahead and click that, it will connect. So now we are connected and we can back out to the home screen. We hit the start and we are in the main screen here. Now this screen here is where we will be able to adjust our servo speed. As you can see here, go up and down to your liking on aileron elevator rudder, you can come down and go to agility here. You can go more agility, less, everything you need right here on the screen. You can also come down to your gyro settings and you can set your gyro. You see I'm adjusting agility now down. You can go from zero to 100, anywhere in between there that you would like. I like it at 75, so I put it back. Now come down to gyro. You can adjust your gyro for aileron, elevator, and rudder. Go ahead and up the gain on rudder a little bit, take it down, anything you need, super fast and simple. Now make sure you save the parameters on the top right. Now we go to the next page, which is the mechanical setup. So now this setup here is where you would do your servo centering. You see, once you click servo centering, that mode right there, make sure that all of your servos are now centered. So if you need to make any adjustments, you would click servo centering, channel one, two, three, four, and you would adjust each channel that you need to adjust and then the same with your main blade pitch come down to your main blade pitch you can adjust your positive zero and negative so it's really nice you can dial in that zero pitch you can get that positive and negative to your liking and again make sure your servo centering it is on and you save the parameters so now we are ready to put our canopy back on and go fly, but you can leave your canopy on while you're doing this. That's what makes the app so incredible and so nice with Goose Guy. And again, you can do it on the S2, you can do it on the RS4, any Goose Guy product, which is what really sets them apart from everybody else. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you have, give this video a like, subscribe, take care, and have a great day.